So I think at here at Point Loma Nazarene University, we're at the precipice of being part of this new boom for the area that we're calling sports science. advancing our sport performance degree to include a pathway that will create opportunities both curricularly and professionally for those that are interested in sports science. And the National Strength and Conditioning Association has created a certification program that gives professionals a home, a, a body uh, with like-minded professionals that they can uh, join with to help advance this profession. So I think the reason why sports science is so important is because it lets us use uh, the scientific data that's already there to implement an evidence-based approach into athlete performance, athlete care, injury surveillance, and uh, minimizing the risk of injury. One thing I really saw with the athlete monitoring program and how that played a role in athlete care and injury prevention was being able to see how the athletes progress throughout their seasons. These athletes were you know, hitting certain numbers at the beginning and we can see their strength progressing throughout their program and throughout the different monitoring sessions that they're doing to see how they're improving on their marks and seeing is their strength conditioning programs working for them. Throughout this sports science internship, we've uh, really had the chance to get hands-on experience with different types of technologies such as force platforms, velocity-based training, timing gates. The focus is often on performance and how to get athletes to do their best physically and the mental component is often neglected. With the help of athletic trainers at Point Loma, we've distributed questionnaires to student athletes, and it's been very impactful with a lot of the athletes that needed help. They've been able to get help, whether it's through talking to an athletic trainer or a mental health professional on issues that wouldn't have been detected otherwise. In the two and a half years since its inception, the athlete monitoring program at Point Loma has served over 400 athletes, from the youth divisions all the way up to the national and Olympic caliber levels. And so far, over 30 undergraduate and graduate level students have assisted in data collection, helped to analyze that data, dialogued with coaches and with athletes, and have published research using that data at both regional and national conferences. So I am an athlete on the track team here at Point Loma. Now to get to be um, helping out with the AMI, it's been really fun to actually learn about why. So it's been really cool to be able to take all this up here knowledge and then learn how I'm gonna be able to hand that to a strength and conditioning coach or like a sport coach and get to apply that data more specifically. Having the information from an athlete monitoring program is hugely important and impactful to the decisions we make as coaches not only on the long-term scale, so we can see long-term athletic development of our athletes over the four years that they're with us at college, but also on the day-to-day -day scale of seeing their individual readiness levels. So as the strength and conditioning coach here, I've been able to partner with our sports science team and utilize velocity-based training with some of our athletes. Through velocity-based training, we have been able to better prepare our athletes through the estimation of one rep maxes, uh, through uh, submaximal load testing, as well as individual prescription of velocity and intensity and, and volume. Being part of the um, strength and conditioning staff as an intern and also part of the sports science team at Point Loma has uh, definitely given me the tools to be able to go forward in the world of sports science and strength and conditioning. A lot of the opportunities and technology that we use here are things that other people don't get a chance to use. I believe the Athlete Monitoring Initiative is unique to other programs out there because not only are you getting the knowledge and experience, you are going to be part of a family on when you're in the Athlete Monitor Initiative. 